After a horrifying discovery near London of 39 decomposing bodies in the back of a truck, British police are trying to find out who they are and who is responsible. The truck's driver, identified as Mo Robinson, a 25-year-old man from Northern Ireland, has now been charged with 39 counts of manslaughter and conspiring to traffic people. He was the first of those arrested to be charged in what is considered one of Britain's deadliest cases of human smuggling. <laughs> Cries for help from families in Vietnam who fear their children are among the dead. A text message from a young Vietnamese woman to her mother is part of the developing picture. She texted, I'm sorry, Mom. My path abroad was not a success. Mom, I love you so much. I can't breathe. She is thought to be one of the victims. Her family paid tens of thousands of dollars for her to be smuggled into the UK, where they hoped she would have a chance at a better life. But on Wednesday morning, 31 men and eight women were found dead in the refrigerated trunk at an industrial park about 30 kilometers east of London. British police had said they believed the victims were from China. Now, they're not entirely sure. We cannot realistically speculate at this time about the nationality of all of our deceased within that vehicle. What I can say now is that all of our victims have been recovered. Post-mortem examinations are beginning to determine exactly how they died. Vietnamese officials are offering their help identifying the victims amid growing fears some of the dead may be their own. This father says he's certain his son was in the truck, adding relatives were planning to pick him up. At the moment, I'm going to focus and engage as much as I possibly can within the Vietnamese community. Five suspects are being questioned by police. That includes the truck driver and three others who were arrested on Friday. Irish police also arrested another man in connection with the case.